Hey, Mick Kenyon here from Open Tracking. Today we're going to look at how to complete the participant's import form. And so we've tried to keep this as simple as possible. Um, we've got columns A through to J, and the yellow highlighted columns B, C, and G, uh, these are mandatory, so we, we, we need to know this information. Okay, so it's pretty straightforward. So bib number is race number, um, or, or the number which you're going to allocate that individual, that um, that particular entry. So um, straightforward, big number, uh, so it's numeric values, um, and you should not have any duplicates in there. So, you know, one to, to a thousand, if you like, with no duplicates. Um, name, so this is the, the main tracking um, page. So this is, so this would be the name which shows on the main tracking page, should I say. Um, and so that's a pretty obvious there. Uh, if you see down at the bottom, we've got number five, and that's um, a staff tracker, so if you like a crew tracker, and I'll, I'll demonstrate that on the tracking page afterwards. Okay, um, then column D, which is participant. So this can be where you can add a team name, so I don't know, Gateshead Harriers, or um, you might want, you know, something just to group the, the particular um, or, or teams together, or participants into a team. So I've got um, team one, which is comprises of Elton John and Elvis Presley, and I've got team two, which it comprises of Dolly Parton and Tina Turner. Again, I'll show this on the tracking map afterwards, so it'll make it a little bit clearer. And then we move on to column E, which are the country codes, and uh, Wikipedia has a, a list of IOC country codes on there, um, and so you can do a, a search on, on the, uh, down the page to find the country codes that um, and I'll just flip back over to the spreadsheet but there are um, we've added a couple of other options in there so um, some people like to have the English Scotland Scottish and, and Welsh flags to show next to the uh, participants so we've added the codes um, GBE for England GBS for Scotland and GBW for Wales so those are our, our three additional um, country codes which you won't find on the Wikipedia one there. Um, obviously GBR is, is for Great Britain. Okay, so um, that is a, an optional field there. Um, you can ignore column F, which is the tracker numbers. This will be automatically allocated upon upload and then we'll update it with the actual live tracker which we're going to use for, for, your, um, for your event. Okay. So the next one is onto the course. Um, so you might want, you might just have one course, which you know, um, no difference. So it's all the, the map pins will be the same color. So in which case, just put course one down. Um, but you might want to, for example, split it between either distances, or you might want to um, split them between male and female. And on this particular example, that's what I've done here. So um, on course one. We've got Elvis Presley and Elton John, so they're, they're going to be shown as um, males. There's one, one called Matt Penn and Dolly Parton and Tina Turner. They're on um, a, a separate course, females. And then also I've got Staff Trackers, which is on course three. So once you've completed the, this form, you'll need to let us know what each of the course numeric values equals. So when you're sending that back, just pop it in the email. Course one equals male, course two equals female, and course three is for crew. Um, so next one is um, gender. Again, optional, but um, it, it obviously makes it an example if you're trying to allocate the courses. And also for ITRA and things like that, some reports require the gender to be reported afterwards. Um, and then column J. So this is if you've got um, race results afterwards and you look, wanted to look at the race results and you want to know who's um, the, the fastest female runner or the fastest male vet, 60 runner, etc. This is where you can put your report groups in there so that um, when you download the results or you look on on our results page then you can see who's won the, the various categories so it's uh, easy to filter so okay once you've completed that um, save that off and then send that through to talk to at opentracking.co.uk okay so what does all this look like so um, so if we go over to the example um, tracking map here so these are the ones which we, we've added, and if you can remember, we, we've added 
into the male um, um, course, we've added Elton John and Elvis Presley. Onto the female course, we've got Dolly Parton and Tina Turner. And then we've got the crew trackers um, down there. And when you click on any of the names, then you'll see the team name there. We put Elton John into team one, and he was group male vet 40. So, um, so you can see, see a little bit more information in there. Um, and then the staff trackers down at the bottom. So if you wanted to see where the, the staff tracker was, then, then you know it bounces up and down when you click on that particular one. So all the colours are different and all of the, the courses are kept separately there. So I think that probably summarises uh, participant input. I hope you found it useful. Thank you.